August 28, 2018 Chris Jackson, Getty Images An expert predicts that Meghan's upcoming fall travels will be a sort of baptism of fire. One royal expert, a former spokesperson for Queen Elizabeth, had an interesting take on Meghan's upcoming fall travels. Dickie Arbati was at the palace for 12 years, and thinks that the new Duchess will undergo a sort of baptism of fire. The event is quite significant, considering it's Meghan's first international trip as a Duchess. Arbati elaborated further, as detailed by Express. They will have a very demanding schedule. The Duchess will have to get used to local customs with the eyes of the world on her. But no doubt she will come through with flying colours and they will show they will be a force for good for the royal family on the global stage. So while the expert has good hopes for Meghan's acclamation to her royal role, the truth is that it could be gruelling for her. But Arbati noted that she and Harry have shown they are getting on incredibly well and always look so fantastically in love. With experience will come confidence and in the next few months I have no doubt we will see her come out of her shell even more, that's great news for Royals fans who love watching Meghan flourish in her new role. Arbati even agrees that Markle has a good rapport with the Queen already, so time could only make those bonds stronger. Meghan Markle has officially been a royal for 100 days, and has transitioned beautifully into being the Duchess of Sussex, https colon slash slash t dot co slash xe 58 b 6 nksnpigtwittercom slash use nudu bap good morning America at GMA, August 27, 2018 The fall itinerary for Meghan will include stops in Australia, New Zealand, Fiji, and Tonga. The royal couple is believed to be arriving in Australia around the Invictus Games, which is fitting considering Harry founded it in 2014, according to Town & Country magazine. This will be the second time the two attend the Invictus Games together, but obviously the first time for Meghan as a Duchess. The game serves wounded, injured and sick servicemen and women and gives them the chance to use the power of sport to inspire recovery. The couple has been noted for reaching out to the younger demographic. And when Prince Harry announced the fall trip, he said that this will be a wonderful opportunity for us to meet and hear from more young people about their ideas for creating a better future. The surreal side of Meghan Markle's fairy tale inside her first 100 days of royalty https colon slash slash t dot co slash i c three i said oh quite two e news at n news august 27th 2018 considering all of the pressure that megan will be under to represent herself in the royal family we hope she had a relaxing summer vacation While she reportedly enjoyed some quiet downtime with the Clooney's, her american family kept up their antics with the media Her mom Doria Raglan may be moving to the UK, and the Duchess also got a new dog. She likely has enough on her plate to keep her plenty busy for a while now.